I guess it was uh, taking some risks, but uh, as I knew that the system will be implemented throughout the university uh, in the coming year, and uh, I thought, uh, why not try at the early stages and uh, try to get familiar with the whole system uh, as soon as I can. Uh, overall, yes, it did make, meet my expectations, uh, even though I haven't used it uh, with its full functionality. I think uh, the student uh, student's response was uh, very well. Uh, I actually conducted a, a student survey at the end of the year, and overall, I would say 70-80% of the students uh, responded very well. Uh, clearly, some still uh, preferred uh, city space over Moodle, but the majority uh, of the students uh, preferred uh, using Moodle over city space. I think uh, the, the system has uh, got more functionality uh, when it's compared with city space. Uh, as I said, although I haven't used uh, the whole functions of Moodle, uh, I think uh, having that functionality uh, giving you the flexibility to, to develop more uh, material and more interactive uh, uh, environment uh, with students. Yes, definitely. Uh, and. Uh, as I did last year, both modules, I will continue uh, running them on Moodle rather than City Space. Yes, definitely. And as I mentioned, uh, I haven't used the system uh, with its full functionality. It was mainly publishing uh, materials and information, uh, maybe a few uh, quizzes and preparation for exams and so on. Uh, but uh, I know that there are a lot more tools there uh, which uh, students can in, uh, interact with and uh, I would love to develop further material uh, by using those functions. Uh, my advice would be uh, to actually stick with the system and uh, try to use it, uh, although there may be some challenges uh, from both uh, students' perspective and also using the technology. Uh, when it goes wrong, uh, don't give up and uh, try to persevere.